A break in the case one day after a U-Haul gas tank was drilled in order to steal the fuel. Well, police say surveillance video of a man carrying a gas canister to and from that truck. That's what led to an arrest. CBS 46's Mary Smith is in Griffin, now south of Atlanta, with the new details. This is the damaged truck now sitting in a junkyard just up the street from where the crime happened. Police say they arrested the man they say was captured on surveillance video after a hole was found in the truck's gas tank. This surveillance video taken just after 9 in the morning Wednesday shows a man walking in the rain with a gas canister in hand towards a row of U-Haul trucks at a storage place on Bowling Lane. The man goes behind one, disappearing from the camera's view for several minutes. When he emerges, he leaves with his gas canister back towards the road. Police and fire were called to uh, USA Self Storage after it was noticed that there was a strong odor of gas in the parking lot. Detectives found this hole in the truck's gas tank. Seen here leaking gas in this cell phone video taken by an employee. Powell says it's unclear exactly how much spilled into the road. Police checked surveillance videos and saw this truck they believe is the suspect's parked in a nearby KFC's parking lot. Its camera also picking up a shot of the suspect. Investigators posted these images to social media for help identifying him. The ID was made of the truck um, because of, of its uniqueness. Police identified the suspect as Jesse Smith. He was arrested Wednesday afternoon. He did admit to the fact that he was out of gas and that's why that was it was happening. The truck towed to a nearby junkyard with a stick wedged in the hole in its gas tank waiting repair. It's definitely something for people to be aware of. Um, you know, it, it, it's something that, you know, people could be out, you know, doing something with the, the mentality of getting fuel. Smith is facing several charges, including theft by taking, entering a vehicle and reckless conduct. In Griffin, Mary Smith, CBS 46 News. Mary, thank you.